Hello everyone, I'm Jenna. I'm one of the teachers at Spirit and Soul Studio. I am the owner of Holistic Human Performance, coach at Bradshaw Personal Fitness, and author of A Survivor's Story, A Holistic Healing Journey Through Cancer. Throughout my journey, my experience of, you know, optimizing my health, educating others on how health is wealth, and if you don't have your health, you don't have anything, our bodies are very important for grounding and really being able at, to hold the soul. Our body is the vessel and our soul is inside the vessel. So if we're not taking care of our bodies, then it's going to be a challenge for us as individuals to be able to continue on with our soul's mission and our soul's journey and purpose. So with that, I have created something called the Sacred Connection. And I wanted to bring it to you all through the Sacred Connection Challenge. So what is it? I bring together mental, physical, emotional, spiritual, and energetics, all the components of holistic health, and marry them together to teach you and transform your body, your life, your emotions, your mindset, how you feel on a day-to-day -day, day -day basis to encourage you to continue those daily movements, routines, and rituals to optimize your health and be able to feel good on a day-to-day -day basis. You know, I had, I had mentioned a story in my book, A Survivor's Story, um, in, in the forward actually that my mom wrote and there was one part in particular that a lot of people actually do uh, speak to on this and it was when I was about I don't know three and a half four years old and I was going through the thick of it when I was going through chemotherapy um, going through cancer at a really young age childhood cancer and we would go on walks. I was born into a very holistic, health conscious family, very active. We all played sports. And at this point in time, my mom was like, okay, I'm gonna take her for walks. So as I was walking, she could tell that I was really getting fatigued. Um, and so she was like, okay, do you wanna get back in the stroller? And literally I said, no, I want to walk. So even at that age, I knew how important movement is movement is medicine there's no if ands or buts and so what i wanted to bring to you all is a challenge this week challenge of these low level movements which i call mobility movements where you're working on a joint by joint approach um and i separate it into body parts so we start with the upper body then the mid body and then the lower body and with each of these body parts, you have your chakra systems that are connected to each of the body parts. So I go over the chakra systems, the different affirmations that you can say with each of these movements. And again, you're getting blood flow movement, you're moving that energy around and you're able to transmute that energy. So that's why I wanted to bring to you all this amazing challenge to transform your life. You can learn, you can take these tools and utilize them on a daily basis and literally every day. Um, they, don't, they don't get old, it's something that your body will utilize and thank you um, on a daily basis. So I wanted to bring this all to you and to really help you understand the importance of why movement is medicine and how everything is connected into holism. And again, I'm really excited for this challenge. So each day I'm going to be giving you a video on each of the specific movements. So starting from the neck, going all the way down to um, your lower body. And with each of these movements, we'll have affirmations that will help you start your day, end your day, you can do them as many times as you want throughout the day, and they build on one another so that you can eventually put it together as a circuit. Um, with this, this will encourage you to do this on your own and again, transform your life. Without your health, you don't have anything, so this is really important to ground into your body and really understand where you're holding energy where you're holding stagnant energy and how it can create and manifest disease illness and or injury into your body and we don't want that because we're at spirit and soul and we're all here to manifest our best lives 
that cannot happen unless you're fully embodied in it, which includes moving your body, fueling your body, meditating, and understanding the energetics as a component that come together and really create this holism that help you to manifest your best life. So I'm really excited. Each, again, each day you're gonna be getting a video. We're gonna have group chats on Instagram to encourage you and help you understand the importance of this. And I really hope you all enjoy it. And I really would, I'm thrilled that you're all here and we can come together as a community to understand the importance of this. So. Without further ado, let's get started into our challenge. See ya.